What's up and what's goody? Hope everyone's doing good today. It's Sunday. I like to call it Sunday Chill. This is the prelude stream. I have um, two more that I have to do after this one. I have to do one for Ghost of Tsushima because that's going away from the PlayStation Plus Pass almost in no time. I think it's like what, 11, 10 more days, that maybe something like that. And I think I'm halfway done finally got the other half of that island unlocked and it's just so much gray area oof that's gonna be something different and then on twitch i have the end of my sunday chill to where i'm gonna be hosting a movie um if you guys haven't seen it it's called the woman king this is uh being live streamed sunday what is it december 4th or something like that what's today yep december 4th in the afternoon time so uh, my Twitch channel is on my YouTube page. You can find my links if you want to engage, want to interact with me. You're more than welcome to. My email address is on there as well. We're playing the council. This right here is a nice walking simulator, but it's more than just that. It's some old Illuminati type bullcrap. Illuminati? I don't know. What you guys think of that um, Adele remix? Hoping that everyone liked it. <sighs> All right. Let's see. I'm rolling with the occultism. Power of the hand. And if someone's talking crap, he's like, eh, talk to the hen. Hold on, let me first. Nah, I can't do it right here. Alright, I only got one point to use. Yeah. You're so chumpsy. You guys are so chumpsy on your points. I'm gonna save it. Probably. I don't know. Maybe. Should I? What else I got? Anything else special? No? Manuscripts? Conviction. Alright. I'm gonna upgrade this. Oh yeah. I love how they're not telling me how many points I got left. Unless I just can't see it. I'm just This will take that to the max. 
for what I needed to. Hmm. All right. Oh, I can't upgrade it. Ain't that about something? I have no points. Jinkies. Love it. Let's go. The servants are not very efficient. Durache can't be far away. They'll find her soon. Their search time is restricted given that they must keep an eye on Adams. I can take care of her, you know. Yes. Well, in any case, I do thank you for bringing her to the island. From what I've understood, the search of Durache's room hasn't turned up any results. Not yet, no. But we've put her son in there. Perhaps he'll find something. Hmm. That might come in handy. Louis grows impatient at not yet having met the famous Lord Mortimer. He will meet him tomorrow. Oh, what a pity to lose a knight at the start of the game. Are you waiting for someone? A young French soldier. During our game of chess? Don't worry, Gregory. The game won't disappear. I'll have one of my men escort you back. Don't trouble yourself. I know my way out. Ah, good evening, gentlemen. Please forgive me for this late hour. It is never too late. And we have much to discuss. One last move? Don't worry. Our games always seem to end like this. Or always start like this. Come, come. Take a seat, my friend. Nighttime stroll, Mr. President? There's nothing like it for a good night's sleep. Do not hesitate to ask a servant to show you back. The corridors seem quite safe. Peppermint, lime flower, and valerian. My miracle remedy when one can't get to sleep. A very good night to you, Mr. President. Thank you. And to you too, sir. And the fluffing drama starts. That's George Washington, ladies and gents. George Washington himself. In America, Mr. One Dollar Bill. He's the president. Matter of fact, he's on the quarter too, right? That's disgusting. I'm coming. Ah, uh, old Georgie boy. Dear oh, let's do some investigating. Please excuse me, but I am unable to join you at present. However, rest assured that we are doing <laughs> all we can that to tap, resolve the case that concerns us. By the way, enclosed, you will find a key that will enable you to retrieve the personal effects your mother left behind. Yours faithfully, Lord William Mortimer. Mortimer. Right, don't worry, we're coming, Georgie boy. I just want to inform y'all, anybody whose name is Mortimer, Mortimer, probably with the last syllable, Mir, you got to keep your eye on them. They're one of those people that's like, they're one of those people that's like hey, come, Mir, hey, Mir, Psst. Mir, Mir, and open the door. He's a bugaboo. We're going to take our sweet time. 
I know his knuckles about sore. What's this? There's a circle around the lock here. Must be the trunk Mortimer was talking about. The key should open it. All right, where's our key? Oh, here's the key. He's getting upset. He's getting impatient. Hurry to answer the door. Nah. There's a All note. Right. A we'll fax get it, of boy. Delicie, to be given to her son, Louis. I should probably take it. You probably should. Um, amber fragments. You just found an amber fragment. Each time you pick up four of them, you increase your maximum effort points by one. Maximum effort points. Okay, I dig it. All right, I've retrieved everything. And we got some royal jelly. Heck yeah. We gotta get the royal jelly. Hold on, Mr. President. What's up, Noxious? Come on in, Mr. Excuse Dollar Bill. Me. Am I bothering you? Yes, you very much are. I was just sleeping. I was sleeping. I need your help. What's going on? Do you remember the young lady we spoke of in the hall? Uh, yeah. Elizabeth Adams. Home introduced her to us. Yes. Well, she is the daughter of my friend, the Vice President, John Adams. But she is supposed to be dead. Yeah, that's bizarre. Fair enough. Good heavens. Good I heavens. Was present at her funeral. <laughs> it is disturbing indeed. Yes. I need to make sure it's her. That's where you come in. I want you to distract Elizabeth while I search her room. Drama. And perhaps get my hands on some important information. At least I hope so. You just want to trifle through her Elizabeth panty drawer. Is in the small salon. If you hurry, you can still catch her. I just need ten minutes. That's all you but need is ten minutes. Is okay. There are two men nearby discussing very important issues, and one of them looks much like Mortimer. Washington is very kind, but I came to this island for my mother, not for his ghost stories. Should have came for some better uh moisturizer. No, we're about to go investigate our vision. Sir, I, I don't feel well. I'm going to have to decline. I see. Well, I hope you won't be needing my help one Me day. too. I must act swiftly. I'll search my room later. He's upset. If only he had more time to go through that panty drawer. Mm, mm, mm. We took away that man's uh Sunday chill. He only needed 10 minutes. We don't want any part in that trifle. All right. So there's these things around here that are coins, collector coins. You pick them up. I don't know what you get to spend them on, but. Yeah, there's one of them. You know, it's like, cool beans, you guys are rich. I recognize this part of the corridor. I'm close. Multiple paths. To reach your objective, it may be a good idea to think twice before embarking on the first path you come to. Right. We'll see about that. I might just jump in there. But they got all these coins laying around in their couches and stuff, and it reminds me of a time where if I was to go to someone's house and my phone was to slip down up in their couch, whatever, whatever change I find in there, that's mine. Locked. I wonder how do the servants go about? Nah, let's get in there. Shouldn't be too difficult. Well, you know, because if the change is down to someone's couch. Obviously, they didn't know it was down in there, or they probably just gave up and forgot. The only reason that they now know is because you lost your phone in the couch. King George the Third in coronation robes. Did they help nice you get your phone out the couch? All right. Sounds like you did all the labor. That's their couch. Their vacuum couch. Give me their phone. Amber Christmas. No, you give me that change. This is some hard work. I had to get on my knees and stretch to get down up in there. Dear E, I received your last letter. Unfortunately, the Crown informed the Golden Order that our mission should under no circumstances 
hamper Sir Gregory's plans. Decidedly, they have support from the highest level in Buckingham Palace. Mm -hmm. So here we both are, hands and feet tied, and little room to maneuver. Keep me abreast of events. Our mission is becoming more complicated. Yours, E. T.S. The French chapter of the Order doesn't appear to know anything about the arrival of our friend Sarah. I therefore cannot comment on it. However, my guess is that she has come here for personal reasons. Yeah, we gotta find Mother Dearest. We keep having nosebleeds and she probably has her medicine. He just wiped it off with his sleeve last time. I'm like, gross, bro. Read it. It's a letter from Lady Hillsborough that she apparently never got to send. Office 101. Buckingham Palace, London? Mm -hmm. Dear Mr. Walsingham, nothing to worry about. I cannot meet you at the palace as planned, as an important matter has cropped up which requires all my attention. You will guess who I have gone to fetch at dear Mortimer's, and thus you will understand my hurried departure. What on earth is she talking about? I can guarantee you will be back as soon as possible. You will understand that to be able to serve you, I must assemble all my assets. You know I put the interests of the crown above my own. Tell the queen I, of course, will assume all of the responsibility and consequences for my absence. Your hmm. devoted servant, e. Oh no. Whoa. I don't have one. So serious. French toast. What? Ah, I forgot to restock up on that royal jelly. <sighs> Yikes. When the timeline is over, an answer will automatically be selected. Hopefully, it's a good answer. Well, at any rate, Emily didn't come here to finish up a deal with anyone. She came here looking for someone just like I did. Hell, it makes like a nasty, sticky noise. It's like whatever noise that is I can't do it actually I don't want to I tried I failed alright so we read this right yep we sure did Lady Hillsborough aka Dutch baby she's a duchess she did an Anna Nicole Smith grammar of Pohayal ah uh. The artistry of the French language in all its splendor. Whoever masters French commands the world. At least really? une partie of it. Okay. All right. Whatever you say. I'm still learning. Ha ha. Mi amore. <gasps> Is she sleeping in bed? She's fast asleep. Well, let's get out of here. Uh uh. Ogo. Ugu, what? <laughs> no, let's get out of here. Ugu at Emily while she's sleeping? No, that's some creep vibes. What's that in the corner? Nope, you're gonna get caught. Is this some royal jelly though? I'm gonna take that and get the fluff out of here. Before she wake up. Actually, yeah, let's get going. Aw, oh, for real, I'm stuck. I gotta, be, I gotta be in here. I ain't even... Dang. Ooh, you better tiptoe. I don't know if you got on Jordans, but you better tiptoe. Shh. We're trying to be sneaky. Did she just breathe? Why is she dressed in like, uh, in those kind of clothes? I ain't trying to look at you, Dutch baby. I'm trying to see what you got up in this room. I'm looking for them royal jellies. A letter from William Pitt the Younger addressed to Emily. He's the present Prime Minister of the United Kingdom. Mm -hmm. He has indeed some powerful backers. Yeah. Uh, oh. Thank you for consoling the Queen. The King's situation is worsening, but I wager he'll recover from this present fit. Next time you speak with Her Majesty the Queen, would you please be so kind as to ask her to look into my petition to raise taxes with the King? I will personally see to it that our nation will recover from this impasse. But King George's mental situation is slowing down our decision taking. Thank you in advance for all your help. William Pitt, Prime Minister of the United Kingdom of Great Britain. Okay, cool beans. Is that all? What's this over here? 
I know it's a stair safe from Roman call. Hey, I told y'all they so rich, they just be coins everywhere. They don't even care. For some odd reason there's coins in their boots. Was the shoes over there too? I don't know, I think there were shoes. She just took her shoes off. It's ching ching ching. Coins everywhere. Two coils circle the lock. Ah, I just use our sneaky sneak skills. Dang, you did that fast. Dear Gregory, thank you for the information. I've managed to find out about the names you gave me. George Washington is a man you can trust. In spite of his obvious talent for politics, he has remained upright and honest. On the other hand, as you may well know, he is already doing business with Lord Mortimer. It will be more difficult to approach him. Napoleon Bonaparte was unknown to me until today. He's a passionate young French soldier for whom Mortimer predicts a promising future. Take heed. He is a man of conviction, which to my mind makes him potentially dangerous. As for Sarah de Richet, what more is there to say? You already know each other. She was apparently invited by Lord Mortimer about an ongoing matter in Paris that concerns a receiver in stolen art. See you soon. Duchess Emily Hillsborough. Oh, okay. All right. See, I told y'all all that fluff that's going on. This is bogus. All right. I've retrieved everything. We don't have more jellies. What's a this? From William Pitt the Elder, addressed to Emily. He was the English Prime Minister. This letter dates from 15 years ago now. Madam, I shall never thank you enough for all your care and attention. I shall be indebted to you until my last breath. If you have any request of me, you only need ask. With regards to my son William, I shall never thank you enough for looking after him. You know the latter's preferences, and you will understand he needs you desperately. For that, and as agreed with Queen Charlotte, our friend Duke Hillsborough will carry out his task and meet with you within six months. From then on, you'll be free from want. Yours sincerely. William Pitt, Count of Chatham. Man, Louis, you're a great reader. I'm glad you read out loud because <laughs> you do a better job than me. Shh, Dutch baby's over there. Look at her. I can't even look at her. Search. We don't have that. Man, she just leave her stuff all open. She don't close it. You don't think Buzz can get up in your... Alright. Don't leave. Here you go, yep, yeah, I'll glide the room for you people out there that was trying to get a great look. Dutch baby, she 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 the real deal though. An origami. An origami? This origami talks about the disappearance of a child. Alright, well uh, let's take it. Only borrowing it, of course. Sure. Hurry up before we get caught. Yeah, I know she really wasn't sleeping. She heard us. Sir, I understand your eagerness, but the pressure on my family complicates the task. Relax, my friend. Your relatives will soon be huh. safe. So what I saw in my vision really did happen. <sighs> well... I hope I haven't missed anything important. I thank you so much. Don't mention it. Now that's settled, let us speak about your support. Yes. You mentioned earlier some assistance from the Golden Order? Absolutely. I have concluded an agreement with their leader, Lady Sarah Faustine de Richet. Another case that Mother didn't tell me about. The funds from the Order will finance the building of a foundry in Tuscany. You will soon be able to count on a hundred or more cannons for your future campaigns. I... I was not expecting so much help from you. When can I meet this uh, de Richet? Well, unfortunately, something has cropped up. De Richet has disappeared. Disappeared? What? Here? Yes, but the staff are redoubling efforts to find her, I assure you. 
So the agreement, is it on or off? It is on. Her right-hand man has just arrived here to help us find her. And it is none other than her son, Louis Maurras de Richet. I wager he will ensure his mother's commitments are met. Louis. Not an easy name to live with in these times. Uh, of course. But from now on, you will deal with him. This man. He can only be Mortimer. Very well. I will seek him out. Oh, man. snap. What? What do we do? Aw, oh, don't be all slow motion. What can I do? I, what? When? How? Are you fluffing kidding me? I didn't I see anything that I could do. Oof. That's frustrating. I didn't see it, any like X or any button to press. I, I guess I was supposed to do something. I didn't go right, did it? And we went back through her room. Yeah, it's kind of what you get. Emily. I can explain. Perhaps, but remains disconcerted. Someone threw you off balance. The cost of effort points increases when using your skills. Oh, no, that's great. Still. But, but first, you could perhaps remove the blade from my throat? You have ten seconds to explain your presence here. Appearances can be misleading. I'm I'm only passing through. And the origami bird. I suppose it simply flew into your pocket. Actually, I was just putting it back. Oh, don't push your luck. We're what bad at this. What are you doing in my room? Uh. Come on. That's locked. Locked. Should have kept quiet the first time. Childish games are trying my patience. There's not much more I can say, really. Are you trying to make me angry? You have been a great disappointment to me. Please leave now. That was my first time I felt. Man. I was not ready for that. Usually I go the other route. I go the route where I, I roll with uh, George Washington, what he want to do. And with... Um, Piagi, Pierogi, that guy. Man, we fell horribly on that one, Louie. You should just go to bed. That was a yikes. I see it. Uh-uh, where is it? There we go. I told y'all, there's coins everywhere. Everywhere. Can I go downstairs? Nope. You know, this game would definitely be awesome. Like, it is pretty fun. Don't get me wrong. But it would definitely be more awesome if you could have more of a linear, I mean, more of a, uh, a non linear kind of route to go. Idea. They basically guide you in one direction, and you gotta go to that direction. Quorum guide. I'm just looking for coins. That's not the right oh, way. Oh, I guess we can't go through there. My bad, Louis. Oof. Okay. Can I go through here? Nope. So we're gonna turn down George Washington. We failed with the confrontation with Dutch Baby. And we. What else? 
Eminence. Your Eminence? What are you Him, doing here? Mr. Piagi. I wanted to speak to you about something important. Do you still have my letter on you? The one I gave you in the home? Why do you ask? I have a name to add to it. Um. Here you go. Here it is. Thank you, my son. Ah, I see that it's still sealed. I was right to put my trust in you, Luis. Now give me one second, please. We did open it, but we resealed it. I can't imagine what would have happened if I hadn't added this name to the list. Please, be sure to give this letter to Sarah the moment you see her. You can count on it. Have a good night. You have a better night. Let's take out that heavy robe. You know he about like 115 pounds. That robe make it look like he a big body. We know better. All right. Okay. All right. Okay. No. Nope. Can't go that way. Let's go to bed, Louis. Exhausted. Me too. To bed. We done lost the origami. Mother stayed here right before me. You never know. And Mortimer had better show up. How y'all feel? Would y'all like sleeping in something that weird and awkward? Look at that. Look at that. Automatic nightmares. No stinks. Ah. Uh, look at my failures. I've been spying on the men in my vision. I've shown Piagi's letter. I did not. I did not convince Lady Hillsborough. Lady Hillsborough was had. She recovered the origami. We messed up there. Um, I could have prevented a violent confrontation. I could have found out something about my mother's past, or I could have helped Mr. Washington with his projects of. Sifting, sifting around. Um, who's that? Lady Adams, the girl with the mullet. Yeah, he wanted to go through her panty drawer. We was like, no. Man, I guess whatever. Okay. Maybe. Oh, there's my points. I get four points. Alright, so on this gameplay, with this route that I'm going, I'm going to get my manipulation up, get that to the next level, get that to the next level, and um, they do let you use other skills from another tree, but you have to get it like substantial enough. It has to say skill acquired. Neither one of these are acquired. Why? I don't know. It's yellow, but I don't know. Be a better lot picker. Get my science and medical skills up, which is probably what I'm going to do. Erudition. We know stuff. All right, validate them points. that green dot up there oh okay 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 all right in my vision yesterday I saw that mother had this room before me I better search the room who knows maybe she left me something behind Oh. Conviction. Etiquette. Oof. Science. Hey. Linguistics. Or occultism. I thought I already selected that. What you mean? Hmm. Alright, cool beans. Ladies and gents, I'm Fluffy Justice, aka Fluffy J. Um, I'm gonna call it off here. That was a uh, that was kind of like a side route of the gameplay.
for the council. Like I said, I went with Mr. Piaggi and I went with um, George Washington the other time. I kind of like that one a little bit better. That whole trying to spy on Napoleon and trying to spy on Mortimer. I don't think that's really worth it. There's more action and more excitement in the other type of gameplay. The other alternative route. Or the alternative route. That was kind of an oxymoron, right? So, uh, next up, I think I'm just going to go ahead and vibe off of some Ghost of Tsushima. I need to get further in there because I think I have 11 more days before they take that off of the PlayStation Plus Pass. And I've come a long way. I think I'm halfway there. That game's more exciting. So, you guys keep enjoying your Sunday chill. I hope everyone has a great one. Mental Healing Mondays. You can catch me on Twitch. Fluffy Justice. And there's an underscore at the end. I do a live stream on Twitch for Mental Healing Mondays. You know, because we all need to heal. Whether it's one day, two days, that's a day definitely to pay attention. It's more about listening than watching. But I do do some pretty great uh, gameplay with Ghost of Shima, So, peace out, everybody. <laughs>